As we get closer to June and possibly the start of the wet season, we begin to see a change in the air for the month of May, that bridge between the dry and the wet season. And it seems as though we could be seeing a bit more of that moisture coming by possibly as early as Thursday and definitely by Friday. So we're looking for some welcome rain clouds then. But before Friday, definitely only sunshine will be the, on the cars for those of you in Tobago, Parlatuvia, Roxborough and Scarborough. Just occasional showers first thing in your morning and uh, throughout the afternoon again, mostly fair weather is expected across Tobago. For central areas of Trinidad, the sunshine will be out along the northern range. Watch out for just the occasional shower. Most of those showers should be fairly brief, less than half an hour in a duration. And similarly, across the southern parts of Trinidad, again, mostly fair weather is expected. San Fernando and Point Fortin may well see a few early morning showers, and some of those may last into lunchtime. But overall, you'll be seeing a lot more sunshine and also some hot weather. Now, how hot will it be? We're looking at highs of 33 degrees Celsius in Trinidad, 31 expected in Canaan, possibly 32 in Scarborough. So if you're out and about, take the necessary precautions with the heat. Now for the rest of the working week, it seems as though temperatures will take a dive, especially by Friday. A lot more moisture is expected. That humid weather will likely bring those showers around. Possibility of a thunder as well erupting around the Trinidad. So you can watch out for that by the end of Friday. And by Saturday, things should begin to clear. Heading offshore, not much is set to change. Two metre wind waves expected. Easterly swells remaining short at eight seconds. And those east to east southeasterly winds of 20 knots continue. So if you are heading out to bathing, you only have one low tide at 12.45 p.m. So that's weather and that's it from me.